Okene Kogi State. Okene Kogi State. Orwell Peace from Federal College of Education, Okene Campus. Had a neck pain problem for about two years. After the prayers of the man of God on Friday, the pain vanished away. Praise the Lord. Also from Okene Campus, Idafibia Ruth had persistent headache. But after the prayer of the man of God on Thursday, instantaneous healing took place and the headache disappeared. Praise the Lord. Edo Jacob Oloche from Okene had severe neck pain during the prayer of the man of God. The man of God said they should lay hands on the problem. She obeyed, laid her hands on the place where the pain was excruciating. According to her writing, instantaneous healing took place and the pain vanished away. Praise the Lord. Andrew Wiener Miracle from FCE Okene had eye problem that had persisted for two years. After the prayer of the general superintendent, the eye became clear. And Andrew says, I can see well now. Praise the Lord. Anna Sani from Ahache Irocheba group of districts had cancer. This cancer had persisted for over three years. Evidence, according to her writing, she could hardly stand for three minutes without any support. But after the prayers of the general superintendent, on the 22nd of April, 2021, she says, is a day she will never forget. That she stood for a long time and checked afterwards to discover that cancer has dried up completely. Praise the Lord. Ozikoto region is next where Brother Sam Karim sent this in. According to his writing, before now, an object normally moves in his forehead. But on Thursday, after the prayers of the man of God, he found the object no more. Now he is healed, he is whole. Brother Musa Kazim testified that for about three months, his joy and hope was taken away. He said it was a time of tribulation. However, as the man of God prayed on Thursday, his burden was lifted at Calvary. All burdens removed. And he says hope has been restored. Praise the Lord. A woman named Helen Moses wrote to testify of how God healed her leg pain, which she said she has been battling with for three years now. She said that the miracle happened last Friday. As Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumuyi was praying, it was as if, according to her writing, someone was pulling her leg. And the pain came up severely. And then suddenly, the pain vanished away, both from her chest and from her leg. All pains disappeared. Also, from the same location in Pabe District, Rachel David testified how God healed her leg pain. She said she could not stand for a long time. But after the prayer of the man of God on Friday, she tested herself on Saturday, tested again on Sunday. She said it is a miracle. She can now stand for a long time without feeling any pain. Praise the Lord. We go to Guagualada group quarters in Paiko, where Sister Afyong Abu testified of the healing power of God from excruciating foot pain that made it inconvenient for her to work properly. After the prayer of Papa Kumui, as she wrote on Saturday evening, she received her healing. Also, 
there was a transfer of miracle power to her sister who was far away and had serious stomach problems for months from where she was she connected and miracle connected with her and she was completely healed praise the lord sister mary abu testified of the healing of god from a serious sharp pain she had been feeling on her knee for weeks and had stretched and applied some medication all to no avail as the man of god prayed on friday she wrote she was healed completely of all the pain praise the lord sister comfort ene alu also testified to the glory of god of how of testified to the glory of god of how waist pain disappeared after daddy kumuyi as she wrote prayed she received her total healing praise the lord hallelujah amen put your hands together for jesus for all the miracles over various places all over god is touching people god is touching lives god is working miracles and you will be the next you will receive yours tonight let's take just two from here only two please be brief and the rest of us just stay where you are the rest don't go at the end of the nice tonight's program we want to listen to your testimony stay there and uh, others will be joining to also share their testimony let's take two quickly the first one praise the lord hallelujah is bro sylvanus vicky and i'm from a y district asokoro group my testimony came on saturday and it happened that that saturday a friend of mine who we live together we were just discussing and he said baba has come to last for six days he said so in these six days we cannot afford to lose him to just go back without receiving from him and then we talked it as casual as it was but when i went back home um, with that desperation in me, I went to bed and I could not sleep. I lost sleep instantly. Then I find out that I woke up and began to pray, and that was how I prayed through to the next morning. And then when I went to rest, I had a dream, and I saw myself fighting with a male figure. And the person pulled out Biro to pierce my eyes. So when the person pulled out that Biro to pierce my eyes, to the glory of God, I was able to defend myself and then defeat the person. But the next morning, I got a call from someone who knows me, from my state and he asked me he said are you fine i said i'm fine he said no i'm just i want to know if you are not fine i said no i'm very fine please he tell said, us what the lord has done for you brother so, so the person said she saw me and i was pierced in my eyes by another figure which i did not share with her that that was a warfare i passed through in the night and then the next thing that happened is that god also revived my spiritual life in the sense that i've been yearning for that kind of life where i will i will i will pray without feeling stressed and i needed that grace to be able to pray through and then by the grace of god this time around god has remembered me in that aspect and i was able to get my miracle i said the lord be praised in jesus name amen heal delivered revived and you keep revived renewed in jesus name uh, the next testifier, please tell us your name briefly, where you come from, what God has done for you. The next testifier, very quickly. Praise the Lord. My name is Brother Alajide Odumusi from Puba Region, PW District. For some time, for some years now, I observed that I was having pain, severe pain at my back. And specifically, September last year, I went to see the doctor, and the doctor asked me to do X-ray. When I did the X-ray and he told me that there is a crack at the lower uh, uh, vertebrae, that's the lower bone of my back, and he told me that there is no drug for it, that what I can only do is to manage it, and what I can do is to, to make sure that I don't stand for too long, I don't sit for too long, and he gave me a, post, a sitting position, and I asked myself, at this age, that is not possible. Of course, I didn't take it serious. I continued. My my, my normal way of life and something happened on saturday and for some it will come and it go it was coming and going god that want to deliver me make the pain to come on saturday in my district when gs asked us to stand up to pray the pain came 
and it was so severe. I said, thank God you came. Now is the last day I will see this pain. And to the glory of God, immediately just finished praying. It was as if they poured cold water at my back. The crack has disappeared and I'm completely healed. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Heal. Pain gone. Delivered permanently in Jesus' name. You are welcome into your own miracle tonight. We welcome everyone in the mighty name of Jesus into the place of miracle. And we want to specially welcome our mother in the Lord. She's been with us since the beginning of the program. She's still with us. You are welcome, Ma. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus, for all the miracles, for all the blessings, and for all we are receiving tonight. Put your hands together for Jesus. As the choir comes up now, the choir quickly, you come up quickly, and get ready, your miracle is coming now. When are you expecting your miracle? When will you receive your miracle? Get ready. The Lord is about to do wonders. He will touch you. Thank mm -hmm. you. 